XFX Tracking Callouts Tutorial 2. In the previous tutorial, we learned how to track a callout. Instructions for tracking can be found in every plugin by toggling the checkbox at the top. Let's edit the template, so we need to be in Edit Template mode. The Build In and Build Out toggles the animations on and off. Untick them if you don't want the animations, you just might want to add simple dissolves. Toggling the build off allows you to butt the callout up to a cut. Pin callout keeps the information end of the title static on the frame, useful when you have to clearly read the data. The pin position can be anywhere on the frame and once reconnected the line will always link with the other point. The on-screen control allows for positioning of the callout and can scale the size. If the link knuckle option is checked, the midpoint of the line will always line up with the connection point. Unchecked, the midpoint can be moved anywhere on screen. Very useful when you wish to connect the line to another point or side of the callout. If we scroll down to the controls of the line, we can modify the width and also smooth out the corner using the roundness slider. Each callout has control over the text and graphic elements. The graphic rectangles can be adjusted for size, position, opacity and colour. Click on the text or the text inspector for fine control of the text such as kerning. As you can see the callout is very flexible and can be configured on screen to exactly match the background.